Some big news now from McDonald's breaking right here on GMA. The world's biggest fast food chain is announcing a major change in the Happy Meals it markets to kids. Now, for years, critics have charged that McDonald's encourages children to crave food that's too high in sodium and calories. We'll have the president of McDonald's USA respond to that in a moment. But first, here's Matt Gutman on what's going to change with those Happy Meals. Time for a Happy Meal at McDonald's. For over 30 years, the Happy Meal has changed not only how kids eat, but what they want from their food. What's the most important part of the Happy Meal? Playing. Which hasn't changed much. But now, as kids rip into the box with that sense of expectation, they'll find something different next to their toy. It's no longer a choice of fries or apples. Now you get both. And only about half as many fries. McDonald's Happy Meal guys! The Little Red Box has offered thousands of toys over the years, but the ageless trio Hamburger, soft drink, and fries has over the years stayed virtually the same at a hefty 590 calories. The new Happy Meal, 100 calories lighter. I don't think of the half the fries we missed. I mean, they, we probably look upon it as not quite as bad as before. In fact, all of the meals have 20% fewer calories, 15% less sodium, and 20% less saturated fat. Not that it's healthy, says Miami nutritionist Rachel Richardson. 89 grams of sugar, that's a happy meal. Yeah. For the old meals, including the bun, the soda, and the fries. A little bit of apple, does that really make a big difference in, in a meal? A little bit um, makes a little bit of difference, and every little bit does count. A big difference would be actually replacing a whole bag of french fries for an apple. Not that kids will mind, as long as they can depend on finding that toy in that little red box. For Good Morning America, Matt Gutman, ABC News, Miami.